Ladies and gentlemen, Simulation for the Nation here. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to everything you need to know about the latest Giants DLC. In this mini-series, we'll be breaking down the 20 pieces of Cavernland and Vicon machinery into four categories. Tillage, grassland, seeding and planting, crop protection. With tillage, grasslands and seeding already taken care of, it's time to look at the final category, which is crop protection. And we're going to start here with the Cavernland Exacta TLX. This is a, a 24 meter fertilizer spreader. Uh, coming in at around about 24 and a half thousand uh, euros as well. It is actually beautiful. Uh, the design on it is really, really nice. Once again, the material textures really coming through the top trumps on this. Um, I have, as you can see, we filled it up and it is currently, uh, the cover is down. So what we're gonna do here is just quickly jump on in and you can see when we, uh, when we cover it up, the side steps go up there as well and the sheet comes over. It does look rather nice there indeed. You've got your working lights on the back end as well. Uh, it is uh, able to go at a top speed of 12 miles an hour, uh, which is nice and rapid for you to get cover uh, a good area covered in a nice quick period of time. They're spreading fertilizer, which is, uh, yeah, it's a very, very nice spinner. I do always like a good look at fertilizer spinner. Next up, we're gonna look at what this vent is carrying here. Now, I don't have any factories for these either, but we are looking at the Cavernland uh, iExtra B18 uh, and the front tank there, which is the iExtra 1100. Uh, now this is a beautiful, what these sprays in this DLC are incredible. And we're gonna have a look into it why in just a second there. But first of all, let's have a look at the detail on the booms there. You can see the, the plastic nozzles really do look outstanding. Very compact unit here as well, but still not without uh, detail. Uh, it is, look, you got your gauge on the side there as well. Stickers all across the boom. As you look on the front tank here for the extra 1100s, uh, great little gauge on the front. The hose is going down as well. Do really, really like that an awful lot. Now this is where this gets particularly interesting. This sprayer here is 20, uh, 18 meter uh, to 28 meter capacity. Uh, and what we do is when we pop into store, we're gonna head into crop protection here. Uh, scroll right along and we're gonna have a look at this one here. This is as you can see our 18 uh, meter capacity But then when we dial it up, that's 24 You can see that our boom numbers increase there even on this instance here They get a little bit stronger when you get to the 28 meters as well So some really nice little features there so you can even if you want a small spray But you still want the, the output you can definitely do it on there. What we're gonna do is jump into here We're gonna pull ourselves back into a little bit more space where we can unload, the, unfold this boom out there and just watch it go. Looking fantastic. Very nice seamless control. And look at the width here for a, a three point linkage for a mounted uh, sprayer there. 28 meters is pretty darn handy, I love it. And like I was saying, as we have a look around, the detail on each of the joints here, so you have the, the folding mechanism there, but you also still have the, the nozzles and the pipework going across the bottom. Just looks incredible. Really, really, really does. I love it. The, this is the spring back mechanism here as well. That looks great. Fantastic. Very, very nice indeed. And from one spray, we jump over to the big daddy here. We are coming across to the uh, IX Track T4. Now, this is a huge, huge Cavernland sprayer. Uh, with a working width from 18 meters if you want the small one all the way up to 40 meters so that's 60 feet to 131 feet uh, before we jump into it again let's take a look at the detail here of the we'll come around the other side and have a look at that of the boom uh, the arms on the boom look incredible come around the back end as well uh, you'll notice we do have the thicker tires on here there are two configurable tire options so you can have um, narrow crop tires on or row crops or you can have the slightly wider tires uh, and yeah, you'll see we've got huge booms on there. Uh, as we look inside here, it looks very, very nice. Uh, but as we jump in, much like the uh, smaller sprayer, we can also adjust the, uh, the working width on this one. So there you go, you can see your narrow tires or your, uh, your row crops or your regular tires. And then you can also go 18 meters, 24 meters, 28 meters. So that's where the other sprayer taps out. 32, and then all the way up to a frankly colossal 40 meters there which is just huge so we're gonna buy one of those as well that's already the one we have but what we're gonna do here this really gives you the working capacity of a self-propelled spray without the huge cost uh you are looking at around about sixty-six and a half thousand euros for this one um but 
This look at the fold out, nice gold wing action there. It looks beautiful, but look at that working with. Just about get it into the uh, yards here. That's nuts. Really, really, the amount of ground you're going to get covered in one FL swoop with this is remarkably impressive. I think it's brilliant. Again, that same level of detail across the boom is wonderful to see. Uh, and yes, I really can't look, uh, can't wait to get into the game with these and uh, get some acres covered. But for now, that is everything for our crop protection. And that is indeed everything that we will be covering for this uh, mini series. We will be bringing you live streams over the weekend where we'll be implementing all of the Kvernland uh, equipment as best as much as possible there keep an eye out for live streams on sunday and monday for that uh if you haven't done so already and you have enjoyed this mini series don't forget to hit that like button uh links are in the description down below if you want to purchase the pre uh the dlc from giants directly uh, it is an affiliate link so it will provide a little bit of support to the channel as well and that will be greatly appreciated until next time though thank you so much guys i've been simulation for the nation i hope you have enjoyed and we'll see you all in the next one